Hi Scorpio, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love bite. Scorpio, let's see what's the message here for you today. And yes, these are general collective readings, uh, Scorpio. May not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind. Take what works for you. Leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. So Scorpio. Nine of Cups, Devil in Reverse, Lovers, King of Swords in Reverse. My God, somebody is upset and angry. Uh -huh. Okay. Bottom of my deck, Temperance. Somebody is not very happy in the stagnancy that is... Uh, Somebody is not happy. They want to release something which was becoming toxic or put an end to it. But maybe they're not being able to make that choice which is making somebody feel very upset and angry. Things are not working out maybe as they planned. I don't know. So let's see. I'm going to clarify these cards for you, Scorpio, of course. I did see uh, this card was hiding in the shuffle when I was doing it. So this is this could be somebody very stressed out, having sleepless nights or anxiety or stress or something. So uh, Scorpio and that person's spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Scorpio and that person... Scorpio and that person's spirit if they could say something to each other. Thank you. All right, let's take a few more Scorpio from another deck. Scorpio and that person. And a few more from a third deck as well, Scorpio. And then we'll start the reading. Scorpio and that person. Scorpio and that person. Good to go, Scorpio. Let's start the reading, the first card here. And uh, Scorpio, if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is in the description box below. You can reach me there. The first card says, let's get away together and disconnect from the world. Our relationship seems more like a situationship right now. I feel you're taking my love for granted. I only want two things in life, everything that makes you happy and nothing that makes you suffer. I love you always and forever. I haven't been happy for a long time. I know I hurt you. Please forgive me. Our relationship has suffered irreparable damage. Life is too short to keep your feelings to yourself. I cannot stay silent any longer with these words hidden inside my heart and soul because of they want to burst out of my chest and my mouth. I love you. So one person I think is saying irreparable damage. The other person is saying no. I don't understand why you hide your feelings from me and whenever you do open up, you run and hide. When you do get in touch, you act as if nothing has happened and give me not, little to no explanation as to why you just vanished. This behavior makes me feel unappreciated and not valued by you. I get so annoyed with your constant need to control everything and denial of your triggers. If I upset you, I want you to be honest with me, but you use silence as manipulation to gain control. We should be able to talk it out like grown-ups. I'm overwhelmed with obligations. I see my future with you. I will never forget the day that I met you and I'll always remember the day that I loved you for they are the same. So one person is still wanting, you know, this connection to go forward but the other person is saying, I haven't been happy so let's see I'm going to clarify these cards of course uh, Scorpio let's start with some dialogue message cards uh, sorry angel blessing card let's see what my angels have for you today as a blessing guidance advice or a message confidence 
somebody needs some courage to maybe talk or clear the air instead of getting angry and frustrated but sometimes the spiritual meaning of this card uh, scorpio is also this is archangel michael's very very powerful sword which is used to uh, used to cut through the root of the issue right sometimes cut off circumstances people things which which become toxic in your life i do see somebody wanting to release something very toxic so spirit tell me what's happening here why is the nine of cups in reverse why is somebody feeling that none of their dreams and wishes are coming true one more yeah i think there is somebody here who feels that none of their dreams and wishes are coming true they feel their person is being very selfish very self centered uh, they they want to their person to come and offer them either an apology or a love offer uh, let's be happy together somebody wants to feel good again it's like yeah you know i deserve happiness i deserve to feel respected i deserve all this abundance and uh, they're not happy that their person is being a bit selfish and thinking only about themselves maybe moving on maybe in third parties i don't know they want them to apologize uh knight of uh, pentacles in reverse yep they're very angry this person is angry bitter upset at the stagnancy that's happened in this connection trust issues devil in reverse spirit devil in reverse somebody wants this partnership back they feel there's a blockage which has come into this connection and their person is not moving towards them or uh, maybe giving to someone else or just not opening up their emotions not making the right choices um uh, lovers what's the lover spirit yes there's a lot of anxiety and stress that their person may be moving on to a brand new beginning or taking a leap of faith and or following their passions elsewhere when somebody here wants to rebuild this connection they feel that person is being secretive or uh, being uh, not very open with their communication or maybe lying to them or is uh, is just being plain rude and mean to them uh, by keeping them guessing right so or maybe has an option it's making whoever this person is who wants to rebuild now feel you know a little uh, emotionally overwhelmed right now feeling they their love is being taken for granted feeling that person is not making an effort to work things out with them so they could be spying they could be watching they could be waiting they could be trying to figure out you know, what this other individual is up to ace of pentacles in reverse ace ace of pentacles in reverse somebody doesn't want to be left out in the cold even i don't know whether there's love here or not but somebody is wishing and hoping that that person will not leave them out in the cold or uh, give up the conflict and just take responsibility for this connection they feel that person is oh they're angry they're angry that either that person wants to be single and follow their passions or is turning their back on them not offering them anything stable or secure or long term uh or maybe not offering commitment or ending a commitment night of wands what's the night of wands somebody doesn't want their person somebody doesn't want their person to take off and follow their passions it's like because they want a second chance it's like can we just renew it already just give up whatever you're doing make that decision once and, and once and for all and uh, they feel that person is breaking their heart or breaking promises to them by uh, getting unstuck and not leveling up and doing what they should be doing like maybe offering commitment or offering something long term uh if they feel that their person is just breaking their heart or breaking promises that they made i don't know what what's the temperance then spirit 
what's the temperance why is it the overall energy somebody wants to heal this connection spirit says they want to heal this connection they want the choice to be made so that this particular connection can come back together right spirit yes they're manifesting it big time they could be, could have taken a little time out to wish it dream it manifest it so spirit tell me what is this person manifesting what are they manifesting that this connection doesn't end right whereas the other person could be wishing for a passionate brand new beginning yeah no they don't want that person to take off and follow their passions somebody wants to return here they don't want this chapter old chapter to be shut down they don't want this connection to end death card is in reverse and they want that person to return back to them they feel that person is being immature by doing whatever they're doing and they are they are being mean and they're being hurtful and all that so that's what i have for you till next time then love and light take care namaste scorpio